Yo guys, what's up? It's Teachers Game 2 here coming at you again with another video and I have a little helpful hint for you today about water. So a lot of times people build their bases on top of mountains or on top of things that are hard to get to, which is kind of like the point of building for PvP because if you build it somewhere everyone goes, you're going to die. However, there are ways to make sure that, you know, you can get on, I guess, harder to raid you if you put your bases up higher. Now, the, one of the big problems is getting water up here because I'm going to go ahead and show you. Come on now. Nice and slow because I'm encumbered. The nearest water source is a long ways away, as you can see. So how do you make yourself some water? Now, I'm going to show you how to make water out of thin air in ARC. It's not a cheat. It's not a glitch. It's not anything. It is something that you can actually do. And this is what you're going to need. It doesn't even need to be metal. You just need some reservoirs, some straight vertical pipes, some irrigation taps, and some intersections. Now let's show you how to start this. Now what you do to start is you find a spot where you can put this thing down. And sometimes it takes a second. There it is. So there's my straight pipe. Now you then put down your intersections. Now how I usually do this, I'll do it like this. And go over here. You've got four down. Now then, once you have that, this is the pain in the butt part, you get your reservoirs down, and you put them down on the ends of all of these things. Now here's the important part. I said the ends for a reason. If you don't put them down at the ends, it can cancel out the water. Now, go ahead and go one more row up. Where is this big guy? There it is. So then you go one more row up, and do the exact same thing again. Now what you're doing is there's something in ARC, it's actually in the code, it's called condensation effect. Now what it means is that basically you are going to get water that kind of gathers around these things and they're going to pull them in from the environment around called condensation just like in science. If it's science class if you remember any of that at least. Now with this right here you can build it as big as you want. The smaller you build it obviously the less water you're going to get. The bigger you build it you can actually build this thing big enough in order to house many, many, many plants. Many of them. Now, I'm going to see if I can get one more level up without my griffin. Nope, can't. So, go ahead and see if I can use this guy. So you can build this as high as you want. I'm going to go ahead and build it three tall so you can see what I normally do. Because in Aberration Zone on this map, on this new map, Valguero, uh-oh, that's not very pretty, but oh well. Um, on the new map, Valguero, Aberration Zone, it can be quite difficult in order to access water with a lot of the base locations because they're up high, they're not near water sources, all of that stuff. So you need to find a way around, I guess, a workaround to not having water. And this is the best one that I have ever found. Because really, all you're doing is making your own water. Now, I'll show you what this means. Now, it takes a little bit of time, so once you put these up, you've got about, let's call it 30 minutes. After that 30 minute window is passed, you will have unlimited amount of water. Now the more you put up, the quicker it works because you're gathering more water in from the air around you. So I am building this for you. So it doesn't look very pretty, but if you hide it in like a corner or something like that, it'd be hard to notice. You'll notice not irrigated, not irrigated, not irrigated. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward for you guys until they have water in them. I won't cheat. I won't do any of that stuff. I'm going to go ahead and put down, come on now, a water tap, right? here so you can see the water when it does show up. I'm going to go ahead and sit right here until it does actually show up. I'll cut forward and then I'll show you all the water reservoirs once that's actually happening. Alright, now I fast forward it so you can see you can see water one, one, one. Now all of these are getting the condensation effect and they're slowly building water in them. And check it out, free water. Unlimited, you're not connected to anything down here. It is literally just, con I guess, condensing inside these tubes and you're getting unlimited access to free water. Now this is how you get yourself water without having to do the piping thing. You can build these things. I've seen some people build these things just absolutely monstrous and they've got like 150 different reservoirs on it. But with that, you can obviously have a lot more stuff. So it works pretty well. This is the design that I've made 
There's a lot of other designs. However, this is my personal favorite. Go ahead and hit a like and a subscribe, and I will keep pumping out some awesome videos for you guys to help you out with your different base locations. All right, and this is the unlimited water trick, I suppose you can call it. Teacher's Game 2, out.